often what you see when you are dealing with people who are in crisis isn't people who have a mental illness. In fact, in my experience, that's actually quite rare. What's far more common is that the person that you're talking to has become overwhelmed by catastrophe. So their life has fallen apart in some way that makes what they're doing actually impossible. So maybe someone very close to them in their family that they were depending on has developed a very serious illness and that's thrown their entire financial state into utter chaos. Or maybe they've developed a condition that makes it impossible for them to work. You know, you, you can imagine the potential range of catastrophes. And they're coming to see you because they're anxious and depressed. But the reason they're anxious and depressed is because everything they have ignored has popped its head back up and is hell-bent on their destruction. And it isn't their mental illness that stops them from being able to deal with it, although whatever weaknesses you have are going to interfere. It's the fact that what they're facing is no damn joke. And if you were facing it, you'd feel exactly the same way. So then you're trying to come up with practical solutions to these tremendously complex problems.